Re-recording a video just to change its scale, angle, or side seems stupid and can be very time-consuming and tiresome. So how can one fix these minor problems without starting everything all over again? In this video, we're not only going to teach you how you can change the scale, angle, or side of your footage, but we will also let you know how to create flipping, rotating, and scaling animations. So let's dive into it. Hey everyone, welcome to Filmora MVP YouTube channel. Here we teach you the latest editing tips, camera tricks, and filmmaking techniques. Before we start, make sure to subscribe to the channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon. So you have recorded a video, but now you think you should have recorded it from a different angle or scale? It seems impossible to change it now, isn't it? Well, you can change various things like scaling, side, or rotation of your video using Filmora 10, so you don't have to re-record it. Make sure that the Filmora 10 video editor is downloaded and installed on your computer. We have attached a link in the description below from where you can easily download and install it. Let's get started. First of all, let's see how to flip, rotate, and scale your videos. Open Filmora and go to Import. Select Import Media Files. Select your video and click Open. Now drag and drop the footage into the timeline. If prompted, select Match to Media. Double click on the footage in the timeline. From the menu, expand the Transformation tab. To flip the footage, click on one of two icons in the flip section. You can either flip the footage horizontally or vertically, depending upon your need. Now to rotate the footage, use the rotate handle to rotate the footage. And you're done! The last feature is scaling. You can either scale up the footage or scale it down using the scale slider. Manage all three options accordingly and hit OK to save the changes. Your final video is ready. OK, so now you've learned how to scale, rotate, and flip the video. But how do you animate all three of these with variable values? Well, it's very simple with Filmora's keyframing tool. And this brings us to the second part of the video, which is how to create scale, rotate, and flip animations in Filmora 10. Import the footage that you want to make the animation of. Drag and drop it into the timeline. Now there are two methods of creating keyframes. You can either right-click on your video and select Add Animation, or select the footage from the timeline and click on the keyframing icon placed above the timeline. Just make sure that your playhead is placed exactly where you want to start the animation. Now by clicking on the keyframing icon, it will add the initial keyframe to the timeline, which you can see as a white dot on your footage. Now move the playhead to the end of your footage or where you want to finish the animation. First of all, let's make the rotation animation. To add rotation to the footage, use the rotate handle. Let's make it 360 degrees for now. If you can't set a specific value from the handle, you can also manually put your angle value in this text box and hit enter. Now press spacebar on the keyboard to see the results. Looks smooth! Now let's create a zoom in animation using scaling, keeping the playhead at the ending keyframe. Change the scaling to 180%. Hit space to check the results. Great! Lastly, let's make a flip animation. To do that, we have to divide the footage into multiple parts with the help of the split icon located on the playhead. You can also press Ctrl B as a keyboard shortcut. After splitting the footage into several parts, double click on any part of it, navigate to video, then transform. Under transform, select horizontal flip and hit OK. And do the same with each alternative part of the footage. Once you're done, hit space to see the results. Hilarious, isn't it? Now you can combine all these animation techniques to create a masterpiece. So now you have learned how to change the scaling, rotation, and sides of your footage and how you can create your own animation using Filmora 10. Try it yourself and let us know about the outcomes in the comment section below. We would love to read about your experience. Give this video a like and don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more awesome tutorials about video editing in Filmora. Hope to see you in our next video. Till then, bye!